Kiora and g'day from the land down under. So today I am doing my first currently page in my wellness happy planner. I have never done a currently page before. This is my first happy planner. I've only done one layout so far. So I'm not quite sure what I'm meant to do in it apart from maybe um, set some goals. I don't think I'll decorate a lot because there's so much on there already. I might just add a few little quotes. So I chose these sticker books here. This one and this one is a new and there's lots of quotes in there I can use and I found some cool boxes in this one. So I already had a look because I had never done one before I wanted to have a look first to see what might fit. I've chosen a few of these stickers um, and they're out of these books. So I'm just I'm just gonna give it a go. So I know for one month I will work on my walking. So I need to get out and go walking. So I want to achieve 8,000 steps a day. I know usually it's 10,000, most people, but because of being in Melbourne, Victoria and Australia, we are, aren't allowed to travel very far away, only five kilometers from home. And we're allowed out for two hours a day now, but it's still a struggle to get those steps in. And I found 10,000 was too much and I would just give up, but 8,000 seems to urge me on a bit better I, 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 it's more achievable let me just put it that way so by dropping it 2,000 steps I'm actually walking more than if I had a 10,000 step goal so I will just write in there that for one month I will work on getting 8k steps a day done one goal finished now looking at these three I thought long and hard about what I want to do for the month one thing that kind of popped out to me was last term during school we we went back to school for two weeks now the cases in Victoria rose very high they were in the 700s which is very high for here. It's the biggest in the whole country. So I was very anxious. I had a lot of anxiety about having to go to school. We didn't have a cho choice as teachers. We had to um, teach from school, even though the children were remote learning. So I had a lot of anxiety and I kept a lot of it to myself. Uh, my work, I have a really good workmate, Kat, who who is there for me but I just didn't let her in so this time so we're going back next term and this time if I have any anxieties I want to open up a bit more to my work colleagues because they're all going through the same thing as I am so I decided to set that goal my second goal I want to sleep better I am going to bed too late and I'm not getting up regularly so I want to set a better sleep pattern and my final goal is to stop procrastinating. So this is helping. I've got goals in my my weekly goals, my weekly planner. And so I just want to keep on with that. No procrastinating. Tick the tick boxes every day and get stuff done. For down here, I'm gonna decorate this bit first. So I thought this one was Good. the best way to get things done is to simply start and I thought that would fit quite nice here now I'm gonna cover this up we don't have Columbus Day in Australia we do have Halloween but we not many people celebrate it so I thought I'd just write my own I don't have many events my birthday is on the first so that will definitely be at the top but I thought if I put this the the purple kind of goes together and I liked the idea that it had these stripes underneath I thought it 
flowed quite well and then I can just pop this one on top like this and it still leaves room for that okay so let's pop in these goals Okay, so these are my three goals for the month and now on to these ones. I struggled with these. I actually googled this because I just I, I didn't know where to start. I've never done anything like this before. So how I'm strengthening my mind, I've decided I'm going to do some crossword puzzles and word searches, those types of things with a nice cup of coffee without technology. Just Maybe not every day, but a few times a week. For my body, I would like to get back into yoga. I haven't done it for years, so I will do yoga, I think, three times a week is a good start. What I'm loving about myself. I never think about loving myself, but I thought of something and trying this, I think, is what I'm loving about myself. I this is way out of my comfort zone I don't like public speaking so creating videos and putting them on YouTube is a big deal and so I love that I I'm giving this a go okay so I thought I could perhaps add in this one because I love that sticker and this kind of goes with that so I thought perhaps that could go down at the bottom. I'll give that a go. So it's quite cool down the bottom. Then I could leave one of these without anything on it. And put this here for my body. Uh, I think I might turn that one over because uh, then the wood's going so put this one here that's for my mind I can write there this is for my body here ghost in my house that's fine is that straight? no that is not straight let me see here weird what do I reckon so I've got room strength in my mind my body myself I should quite like that I think it's cute I have these little butterflies here so maybe I'll put a little butterfly here and I might put this little green guy yeah like so this positive vibes only perhaps that would look I'm gonna give that a go there whatever we reckon I don't know which is gonna be better let's give both a try so put that one back there this one positive vibes only that yes that one I'll use that another time Okay, so now I've got my how I'm strengthening my mind, my body, and what I love about myself. That is about enough. I don't, if I add any more, it's just going to be too busy. So I'm just going to write those things in there. So how I'm strengthening my mind. Okay. So I have finished writing in those boxes. Oh, I will do the dates. So the first is my birthday. Yay. Uh, 
I'll just have a look at my month to see what I've got on. So I've got some uni assignments due. So uh, I've got the second student health AT assignment two due on the fifth school goes back and a school holidays but I've also got two assignments due that day as well so student health assignment three is due and my multi lit 82 is due 31st is Halloween done okay that is my first current link page not too bad let me know what you think give me some ideas of what you've done and for me to do in the future or to give just give me some inspiration of what I'm doing here am I on the right track is this what it's after don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you next time goodbye